Hello and welcome back to Disc Room. Um, it's been a minute since I've played some Disc Room, so it's going to take me a minute to get back into this. Uh, it's also been a minute since I uh, recorded anything at all. I, sl I was a little bit slacking this week. I missed a couple days of, of videos and stuff. Uh, but, you know, it happens. Uh, we're going to be back on schedule this week, I'm hoping. Just got to get through a whole bunch of recordings today, and we're gonna, I'm going to upload them and get all the thumbnails done and set it and forget it, baby. Also, I uh, increased the volume in the recordings for the games. Um, I thought the, the volume for this in Hades was a little too low, so I've increased the volume. If it's now too loud, feel free to let me know. I can't really figure out how this works. Okay, let's check out the map here for a second. Just to just to see what's going on. Okay. So this is the ultimate gate gatekeeper. I don't know if that means it's the final gatekeeper. I don't know what comes after this, but we still have a lot of unlocked rooms. Die from forty-five disc types. We're close on that one, but we can't do it. Die from sixty disc types. We're still not too far from that one. Defeat all four different antibodies in a row. See, I don't know what that means. So we can't really get into that room. Survive for 10 seconds. This is the dark room that is very difficult. We could do this one, I think. It would just take a little bit of work and time. Die with over four discs in this room. That This room, I have no idea what to do. So all the golden rooms means we've survived for over 20 seconds. I don't think there's many rooms... This one is survive 10 seconds in all unlocked rooms. We have not done that. And then there's a room down here. Survive zero seconds or less. Also have zero idea how to do that one. So basically our two options are try to figure this room out. Or start trying to die from all different disc types. Because I don't know how to do this room. I don't know how to do this room. I don't know how to do this room. And I don't know how to do this room. Which leaves us like this room, this room. Oh, we could do this one as well. Survive 10 seconds in all locked rooms. But most of the rooms that I... There's too many rooms that I don't know how to do, okay? We can check out our discs. Uh, now, it, it shows us what discs we've died to. Uh, right to the right of best time. It shows, like, there's a disc we haven't died to in this room, in this room. So we could do those. But let's let's give this a good solid try for a few minutes at least. Kind of get back into the, the feel of the game. Um, I looked up a little bit about this game. There's really not that much information about this game, which is a shame because I think this game is really good for what it is. It's, a, it's just like a small bite-sized consumable little guy, you know? Um, but it seems like... Oh, that was spicy. Oh, I, don't, I feel like I didn't die there, but it's okay. What's the best way to do this? Outside and then center, or center and then outside? Or neither of those? Ah! So we have to survive for 30 seconds in here. How many blocks are in each? Is it only 10? It might only be 10. Oh, but it doesn't give you a full second. Dude, this is going to be really tough. Is Let's try the slow-mo here. Might help a little bit, maybe. Oh, man. This is going to be rough going. I think our best bet is to kind of move in a circle because he, uh, we're dead, right? Oof. What else do we have? We have clone, we have absorb, we have blast. Let's try the blast, I guess. Might be worth a shot. Doesn't seem to be going super well, but it's not terrible, I guess. I don't know. I don't know if that's. I don't know if that's the, the one. This is gonna be real tough. Uh, the dash still might be our best option. Stop going over there. Can I use the D-pad? I can use the D-pad. I don't know if I want to. The thing that makes this really hard is when he has that like slow mo circle around him. 
We want to not be inside of that as much as we can, but I don't know how possible that is. In all honesty. Dude, this is brutal. We have to survive for 30 seconds. Well, we have to clear a whole bunch of tiles. This is going to be very hard. There must be some straps in this, right? Maybe do it in, like, sectors. So let's try bottom left, and then... Oh, my God. Oof, there's just too many moving parts. There's just too many moving parts. There's not enough space to be alive. We're, we're dead. His dash, combined with the saws he spits out, makes this incredibly difficult. Like, what do I do? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. We've done one thing. It, oh, it's different now. Jeez. What does that mean? Oh, the longer we take, the more this he spawns. Okay, at least that makes me feel a little bit better. And that once we get past that first phase, it's not the same thing. We don't have to do that, that this thing for the whole 30 seconds, which is nice. Oh, we should have died there. Should have died there. We did die there. Good stuff, good stuff. Um, is anybody in the comments playing Disc Room for themselves? Um, either way, what do you think of Disc Room? Are you a fan? Are you not a fan? It's a weird game, but I think it, uh... I think it's cool. I think it does some original stuff. And I like that it's kind of just like a bite-sized, small, little fun mini-game game. You, you don't come to Disc Room looking to play a game like The Witcher 3. But for what it is, I think it's I think it's really cool. Yeah, there was no way out of that corner, right? See, like, what do I do now? I think we just need to move in one constant direction as much as we can. And try to not, like... Ugh! It's so frustrating. Infinite frustration. Bruh. Bruh. Let's, okay, let's try this one. I think it's going to be the same problem, right? I mean, the pattern is kind of repeatable. So once we figure it out, I think we're going to be in a good place. Just chill. Stay chill. Stay chill. Okay. Now we got to go. We got to move fast on this. Uh oh. There was no way out. I put myself in a real pickle there. That's not how you do that. No! I do think clearing it in kind of like a circle is our best bet here. It's difficult though. It's, it's just difficult. But we're making progress. We're becoming more consistent. Go, 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 go. There's only two more. We've done it. Alright, third phase. Here we go. It's just these things. This is not going to be easy. I'm just going to do my best to not look at the time. Oh, he's pulling me in. And I think it's getting more and more powerful. We've done it, boys. Third phase was, I feel like, the easiest phase of the three. All right, here we go. Big bang. I just got an achievement. Big bang. Boom. Oh, is that our friend? Did we save her? <gasps> huh? Oh my goodness. There's a t something that's ticking down. I wonder... So in that bottom right panel, he's got confetti on his hands. Uh, that's because I think we changed the blood to confetti. So I wonder if whatever color you change the blood to, if that's different. It must be. Whoa, what the heck? Hold on. I gotta sneeze, boys. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, okay, so he's... Is he starting to melt? Or are we starting to melt? I guess I, guess I don't know if we're a he or she. Uh, there's like a melting baby who's getting bigger. And then there's two of us. Very confused. Okay. Did we clone ourselves and then shoot the bomb into space and explode? I feel like the... Oh. I think we've done it. 
I think that's GG. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to like look up the story a little bit because I I don't get it at all. But uh, for what we play to this game, I thought it was really good. There's still a, a little bit of cleaning up to do in terms of some of the secrets and stuff, and I, I think we'll do that. Let's, uh, can I skip these? I don't think I can. That's okay. I'm, uh, you know, give credit where credit is due. These people made this game. Lionbridge Gaming. There's a lot of people who worked on this game, which surprises me. I thought it was going to be a smaller team. Pretty, pretty beefy. It's crazy how many people go into uh, stuff like this. I mean, all forms of entertainment, really. Movies. Not really books. Really, one person kind of writes a book. <laughs> but you know, you gotta go through a publisher. You gotta go through an editor. You gotta go through like a like a, a promotional people. That's still a lot of people for a book. Come on, sixty-eight percent completion. Ah, could have given me one more percent. Deadliest disc, the saw burst. I don't know what that means. Can I keep playing? Oh, what? Oh, there's now a hard. Interesting. There's a regular and a hard. What is this? There's more? Oh, so this is the people who were left there? Yeah. Oh. Okay, hold on. So now we have to control two people? So there's more game here. Survive for 10 seconds, you go to the right. Survive for 10 seconds, you go to the left. Survive for 10 seconds, you go to the bottom. Okay. We just have to survive for 10 seconds. What happens if just one of us dies? I think I think the game ends even if just one of us dies. If I'm going to try to find out. Nah. Nah. Uh, if purple dies, we're cool. It's just us. So just pretend that purple doesn't exist. I'm not a fan of these guys. Oh my god. All right, that's 10 seconds. So these are just hard rooms, I'm guessing. Oh, this this thing game is tough, dude. There's some tough rooms. Leave me alone. Let's go this way. Let's let's go inside outside. How was I surviving at all before this? You really just gotta move in a circle. Getting the middle ones are gonna be real difficult. Especially this very middle one. Leave me alone. Dang it, dude. Oh, you can kinda get the very middle one right off the bat. This is tough. You, you book it straight to the middle. We're we're getting pretty close, I feel. Oh come on. Dang it, dude. We were one square away. Come on, baby, come on, baby. Nope, that ain't the, that 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 ain't it. Yeah, I feel like that wasn't quite the most efficient way. I want to do it like this. Yes. And then if we can just somehow manage to get that last square, come on. Oh, I stepped on it. I'm, 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 I'm contesting that. I stepped on it. Oof. We're getting real close here. Oh, I missed one. That's going to be the death of us. Well... It would have been if I would have made it that far. Oh, I wonder if that's... Let, let me try something like this. Kind of... Oh, whoops. Game's lagging a little bit. I want to try something maybe like swinging it a little wide. I don't know if that's going to give us enough time. Stop lagging, chief. It's the confetti. The, the game can't handle the confetti. Why am I dying now? I wasn't dying before.
Just give me the square. Gosh. Oh, we did it. It counted. It counted. This is brutal, dude. There's nothing to gain in this room. There's no rooms it connects to. Maybe just some saws or something? No. We just unlocked it. I don't know. What, what kind of fancy things do these do? Oh, they shoot saws out. Not a fan. That room was way easier than the other room. We almost survived for 20 seconds in that room. Alright, let's see what's up here. Another room that leads to nothing. That's fine. What do you think we should do? Should we go back to the other, the regular rooms and try to unlock some of those rooms and try to dice it to some discs? Or should we play these hard rooms? I don't really know. I don't really know if there's a point. I think they're just kind of difficult rooms. I think we should maybe focus on just dying to some discs here. So, like, I'm just going to go from the bottom up and just try to die to all the discs. And maybe I'll check and see if there's rooms that we haven't survived for 10 seconds in, like this one. Like, I bet we could probably survive for 10 seconds in this room. There you go, there's 10 seconds. We also have to figure out what the heck... Oh. We gotta figure out what the heck uh, the golden rooms do. I have no idea. What's in this room? Have we done this room before? Honestly, I don't know. Kill me. What, what the heck's going on here? I do not remember this at all. Defeat five gatekeepers. Oh, this is a new room, I think. What the heck? Okay, uh, here, I'm going to try and absorb this guy. Because if, if I could get him to, to spawn in that one room where it's to die to four discs or more, we could possibly have him spawn all those discs. So let's go to that one room. I've tried this multi I feel like I tried this with a with a saw that wouldn't make it work. But I just have to, ex to I think that worked. It did work. Heck yeah, boys. Okay. We just unlocked this room. Actually, I think I have an idea of what this is. This says it's the path. Which makes me think that it is... I don't know. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm, maybe I'm going out on a limb here. I feel like it could be... The path to survive in the dark room. So let's... I think... Mm, I don't know if that's true. Uh, this dark room could really be an issue. I mean, there's nothing really to do in this room, right? Except just die to a couple new discs. Have I died to this disc? There's one more disc in this room that we have not died to. Let's find it and die to it. It could be that one, I guess. Kill me. It's not that one. Come on. Give me a give me a new disc. Oh. Why, what the heck, man? It says there's a new disc in that room, but I didn't see any other disc. 
Maybe it spawns at like 30 seconds or something. Hmm. Okay, well, uh, I think that's going to do it for this episode. Thank you all so much for watching. I feel like we made we made some serious progress here, but um, I don't really know what to do from here. I mean, we can we can try to unlock some of these rooms and see what happens. Um, yeah, so so expect this this series not to go too much longer. I would say one or th one or two more episodes, probably max. I don't think I'm gonna do these hard rooms. I think they're just rooms to to kind of have fun in. I don't I don't really think there's many secrets here. I don't know though. But thank you all so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it. You guys know the drill. Like like the video helps me out a lot. It helps uh, people find the channel. Juices those YouTube algorithms. Uh, subscribe if you want to come back and see more. And I'll see you next time. Thank you all so much for watching. Uh, goodbye.